Hey guys, everyone, gather around. Gather, gather, children, gather, gather, gather. So, you guys, if you haven't already heard, I have been suspended、um, from Twitter. 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 A place where. People say the most horrific things every day.、Um, Stop me from tweeting my poll, okay? Now, this went from being something rather innocent to me now thinking, wait a minute, there's no way. This is starting to feel. I'm putting on my, my, my foot rubbing thing, y'all. Can y'all hear my little foot rubbing thing in the back? Yeah.、Um, Papa Bear is asleep. So, y'all. Oh, thank you, babe. I didn't realize I could do my poll on Instagram stories. I'll do that. But now listen to this. You guys, has something ever happened in your life and you didn't really pay it much mind, right? But then you slept on it and then you realized there was something even more layered there. You had to unwrap it and unravel it, right? And sometimes, something that was meaningless to you or not that meaningful becomes a gem when you go back and unravel it, right?、Um, a lot of times lately, I've had speaking freely because. My documentary is coming, and I'd rather you guys be able to experience everything the way I'd like you to experience it on the documentary.、Um, I'll never go back on Twitter because now it's starting to feel a little scary. I remember when I was, when I was a little girl,、um, and I would be taken to church. And sometimes the people in church would tell us, be happy that you're able to praise God freely because some people in so many countries in the world can't, can't praise the God they'd like to praise freely. They have to hide the Bibles、um, if, they, if they are a Christian in some countries, right? And that always motivated me to want to be in church and. And enjoy charge because I was like, wow, some people don't get this luxury. Um, and, and what's happened, Ace, is that we used to talk about 50 years ago, and 30 years ago, and 20 years ago. We have become that place that we don't, that you can't speak. You can't speak for the fear of the mob attacking you. If that doesn't give you chills up and down your fucking spine, this is scary. You should be able to ask questions about anything you're putting inside your body. We, we, can, we ask a bunch of questions about, about the most simple thing. Oh, bitch, how that, how that glue w o r k Do that glue, do that, do that glue really、um, keep the wig down for how many hours? Oh, because if I go in a pool and if I sweat it off, and bitch, how that. But you can't just innocently ask a question about something going in your body. 
do y'all realize that I remember going to China and they were telling us, you know, be, you cannot speak out against, um, you know, the the people in power there, etc. And I remember all of us thinking, oh, okay, well, you know, we understand and we respect the the laws here and, and you know, that it's so different where we live. But don't y'all see what's fucking happening? Don't y'all see that we are living now in that time where people will turn their back on you? I'm not agreeing. But people will isolate you if you simply speak and ask a question. Y'all don't see what the fuck is happening? And I'm seeing black women on Twitter, black women I follow, acting like this is funny. <laughs> no, I ain't gonna lie, I had a lot of fun yesterday and a lot of laughs. But black women, are y'all forgetting there was a time not too long ago where you couldn't even make eye contact with people? And you're okay with 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 what's happening. We're no longer even allowed just allowed to voice our opinions or to ask questions. Now here's the here's the here's what's in, interesting. What's interesting is so many of your favorite artists feel this way, but they're afraid to speak up. And I can't blame them. Look at what they just did. I will never use Twitter again. If first of all, I didn't give any facts about any vaccine i didn't give any facts about anything i simply said oh, okay well you know i didn't want to travel with my tiny baby yada 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 and then i said my cousin this is the reason he didn't want to take the vaccine do y'all realize how many men are embarrassed to even speak on things that have to do with their health. Do you know how many men, especially black men, don't go to the doctor and, and are afraid to tell their own wives that they may be having pain or they may be feeling, um, you know, not so well. And this, and this is a, a joke. And, and Twitter can just wake they crush the ass up and stop me from 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 asking questions but y'all y'all hanging out with rappers but but i i don't know i mean it, it's interesting but um i want you guys to find a way if I, if I, um, you know, I told you I got a request to go to the White House, which I thought was really dope. I'm not going to say I haven't been enjoying some of the laughs that I've had from this. It's a, a lot of it has been funny. I'm not going to lie. But this, this man is not alone um you know there are tons of things that that men 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 won't really speak on things the way you know us women will speak on anything we'll we'll bust our vaginas open and, and show each other our vaginas and be like yeah girl yeah cuz i did like but men aren't like that you know and so to make a huge joke right about something that really did happen to someone that's one thing. But then to stop a person from... So what it's making me think now is that there's something bigger to it. You know, like when I kept on seeing all these people with all these conspiracy theories, I would be like, oh, what? Oh, please, you know. But what in the world scared y'all that much that made you disable my fucking Twitter? I have not put out anything that I said was a fact about anything 
I simply said we should be able to ask questions and speak. And it's scary when they start telling you you can't ask questions about anything. Oh, right. Someone said it took Trump four years to have his Twitter disabled, I guess, but it took you three days. Yeah, not even three days. But listen to me, please. Open your fucking eyes. Open your eyes. <laughs> That's all. And yes, I'm writing I'm writing a very a very important thing. I'm writing something really important about all of this child. And when it's Oh, you yeah, you know who I who I wrote a rap about? I wrote a rap about Paris yesterday. It was so funny. It's in my it's in my drafts. But I didn't I didn't bother to tweet it. But you guys, I I'll be back. I'll be back to give you more updates. Um, In the meantime, I love you dearly. Okay.